Hard to believe, but it is already past the midway point of the season for Syracuse football. Game seven this week as the Orange go on the road to take on Florida State and the seventh week of the two-minute drill with Garrett Trader here. Garrett, how would you assess the team's mindset as you guys look forward after a tough loss to another challenging opponent this week? Yeah, we're excited. I mean, new week, new opportunity. we got a tough opponent, so uh, it'll be exciting to go down there and try to go out and get a win. But, um, yeah, it's, it's going to be fun to play against a top-ranked team. You talked about how you guys need to be collectively as a team a little bit more ready to play and get off to a, a quicker start this go-around. What do you think needs to go into the preparation and everything to make sure that you do get off to a faster start? Yeah, I don't think preparation's as much of an issue. I mean, we, we feel like we're pretty prepared going into every week. So uh, the big thing is just coming out and starting hot, making plays and going out and executing. That's that's what it comes down to. And, um, yeah, if we can do that, I mean, put ourselves in a good chance to go out and get a win. It is the halfway point of the season, which is kind of hard to believe. How do you feel physically with the elbow, with the arm, compared to maybe previous seasons after you did the surgery in the off season? Yeah, I feel fine. I'm mean, yeah. still, still managing it, and, um, you know, I'm not necessarily, you know, um, it's a new normal. I guess that would be the best way to put it. So just manage it, make sure I'm good uh, to go for Saturday, and uh, I've been feeling good, though. And you guys have done it on the road against a big-time team this year in Purdue. Since that game, the offense has struggled a little bit more. I guess there was the Army game, and you had some positive plays in that one. But – have defenses changed the way that they are game planning against you or trying to keep you from running as much to the degree that you did against Purdue, or have you noticed anything different? Yeah, I mean, some teams definitely are going to play a little bit differently. And uh, Florida State, uh, you know, they got a good pass rush, but there's um, sometimes, you know, when they play a little bit better runners, they don't rush as hard. And uh, they try to close up those lanes. But, um, I mean, everything else is just work your reads and make good throws and give guys a chance to make plays. And, um, you know, that's what we're going to rely on those guys to go out and make some plays and uh, just give them a chance. That's my job. What stands out outside of that from, like, a scheme perspective for Florida State this week? And you played against them a couple times. Yeah. I mean, they got a talented group. Um, they're an older squad. You know, they definitely – it's their third year in this program, in this system. So, um I mean, just got to go out and try to attack them, and uh, we got some good stuff so far. So it'll be exciting to just continue to work on that, rep that, and make sure we're ready to go. All right, sounds like a plan. Garrett, thanks so much for taking some time with us. Thank you. That's Garrett Schrader. You can catch him on the field against the Seminoles on Saturday, noon kick.